My name is Aaron Chandler and you're watching Coast Chai YouTube channel. The perfect place for theme park news, reviews and vlogs. After all, I've always got roller coasters running through my mind. <laughs> Hello there guys, my name is Chris Shuddogs, the Bomb Bot Bill for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News update from Skyline Park in Germany. Now this is on their 2020 groundbreaking attraction uh, and we do have official news on what the type of attraction is, the height details and also some comparisons as to other rides uh, to sort of guess what the manufacturer will be. Now before we get started, make sure you like the video if you've loved it, comment down below your thoughts and subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now guys, let's get into to this video. So this is from Skyline Park in Germany. They have some great rides, uh, including Sky Dragster, which is their Marathon Spike Coaster. Believe it or not, the first of its kind in the world. Of course, the Spike Coasters have gone around now. Uh, you've got Desmo Race at Mirabalandia, and you've got a couple of Carnival cruise ship uh, coasters that are set to open in the next few years. Now, Skyline Park have been at it again. They're investing in a brand new ride uh, for the 2020 season. We didn't know what it was. We knew it was going to be a groundbreaking new ride and now we have some details. Now all the information that I'm going to read out will be from a European news source uh, called Park Lebnis. I think it's how it's pronounced. Uh, some of the source, sometimes I've got sources from them and they're really reliable. Uh, now let's put a picture of an example on your screen now. That is Eclipse at Groner Lund, and basically that is what we are looking at. Now it's been described on the article as the world's tallest flight carousel will soon be in Skyline Park. It's expected to open in July this year, so look out, look for that to open. It will reach 142 meters. It will transform the Bavaria skyline, uh, and of course Skyline Park already announced back in 2017 that he wants to open a highlight in 2020 that is unparalleled in Germany and I think, and of course a few weeks ago the park confirmed it would be spectacular and breathtaking spectacular, breathtaking, highlight and unparalleled in Germany I think this fits the bill uh, now I put an example on on there of Eclipse now that takes passengers in Groner Lund at least 100 metres above Stockholm giving an impression of the anticipated journey, of course it was the anticipated climb and you sort of swing around at the top at uh, record, uh, well not record speeds but decent speeds for a swing ride and I think it looked brilliant from the POVs uh, now of course there's another example mentioned in the article and that is the uh, giant chain flyer uh, in Orlando which takes to a height of 137 meters so this is set to be the world's tallest flight carousel or swing ride in the normal in the, in the original in the original theme park terminology. Uh, so you can see where I'm going with to, with this in terms of manufacturers. Orlando Starflyer, Eclipse at Grand Alone, the picture that was on your screen uh, that is on your screen. Um, you know this this looks really set to be manufactured by Fun Time, which is an Australian manufacturer. They also manufacture the Sky Screamers, the Texas Sky Screamer, the New England Sky Screamer. They've manufactured all the Sky Screamers at the Six Flags theme parks as well. There's a few out of these fun times out in Germany, and uh, this park will be no different. Um, now, this is the highest experience in the park to date by more than 50 meters, because of course the Skyline Park's Sky Shot attraction catapult up, catapults people up to 90 meters uh, in height. Uh, now the new season at Skyline Park starts on March 28th, so if you're down there, make sure you get a close look at the construction site when it's all set and done. So uh, obviously this ride opens in July, the season starts at the end of March, uh, so it'll be a great place to see construction with this ride uh, as it gets higher and higher and higher. Uh, so the fact that this beats the Orlando Starfire record is unbelievable. Um, the fact they're going to be home to the world's tallest Skyflyer attraction. It's, on, it's brilliant. It is absolutely brilliant. So this has beaten the height of the Orlando Skyflyer. It skyrockets the height of Eclipse, the example that was on your screen uh, from Grona Lund. Uh, so I think with these examples mentioned in the article and from the promotional material uh, released, uh, you can look on the website for a picture from the Stuttgart, from the Stuttgart event, uh, which showed the part promoting the new attraction. From the looks of it on there, it's pretty clear it's going to be manufactured by Fun Time from Australia. Same manufacturer, like I said, of the Sky Screamers at the Six Flags Parks as well. And I think that's a good manufacturer to go for. I know that uh, Apollo is a different manufacturer 
uh, Pterodactyl is a Zampel, a vertical swing um, at Flamingo Land. So I feel like going with a fun time is good. I hope that we see one of these fun times in the UK. Uh, at some point in the future, but this is a good attraction for Skyline Park Germany So thank you very much for watching this theme park news update sharing my thoughts on Skyline Park's new swing ride for 2020 Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video Share the channel out with your friends, family and on social media And for now guys, keep on the coast live and I'll see you guys in the next video very very soon Take care guys, have an awesome day